Hello, folks. Welcome back to one more mindful movement from Gathering Strength. My name is Rodrigo. My pronouns are uh, he and him. I'm joining you from Brazil, and I will be your instructor of today. <laughs> I'm excited. Uh, I suggest you to uh, adapt the movement to your body, okay? And be very gentle to yourself, okay? Which means that if the movement doesn't feel comfortable, uh, I would suggest for you to come back to the breath, okay? And uh, observe the breath, which is uh, a nice thing to do, okay? And uh, if you would like to push yourself a little bit harder, you can do an extra, you know, extra rep as well. So you're gonna adapt it to a body. If you have more stamina, you can do more reps. If you have low stamina, you can do less reps and always come back to the breath, okay? Coming back to the breath, you place one hand in your belly, another one in your heart center, and then you have deep inhales to the nose, and long and soft exhale to the mouth, and then you just stay there, all right? I am paralyzed from the chest down. I have a T3 complete spinal cord injury, so you're going to see me doing this most of the time, I will position myself in the chair. So talking about reposition ourselves in the chair, I would love for you to, you know, find a nice comfortable place in your wheelchair or in your chair, because we're going to do a centering, you know, body scan just to bring ourselves back to our bodies. Okay, if you can do that, it would be lovely. I know that some of us, it's a, a little bit challenging to find a comfortable place in our wheelchair because of the balance. But, uh, you know, try to rock your body from side to side a little bit, just to start what they call some pressure release. Reposition yourself in the chair. And once you find that nice and comfortable place, I suggest you to put your hands on your tights, relax your shoulders. And I kindly invite you to close your eyes if it's comfortable for you. Or you can have a soft gaze. If closing your eyes is not comfortable. And we talked about the breath, so we're going to start observing the breath. And gently, let's have like inhales through the nose, exhales through the mouth, long and soft exhales, and deep inhales. Exhales. And now I invite you to notice how you feel. Notice if there's there any sensations in your body, which can be a physical or emotional sensation. Just notice how is it to be you. And now with each exhalation through the mouth, we're going to soften ourselves a little bit further. We're going to surrender ourselves to gravity. We're going to come back to the body. Try to send energy all the way to your inner heels, to your feet. Feel them touching your wheelchair footrest. And soften the feet. With next exhalation, soften the knees, your tights, your sitting bones. Soften your belly button, your lumbar area, lower back, your arms, your forearms, your hands. Of your chest, your, your shoulders. Your throat, your neck. Your jaw, let it soften. The tongue inside of your mouth, let it be soft. Your ears. Soften your eyeballs. Have you ever tried to soften your eyeballs? 
try it out. Now try to swap from behind the eyes. How is it? This little muscle between your eyebrows, let it be soft. What is your sense of calmness? Beautiful. Once that we are now present, we are in our body. We did this body scan, moving consciously, our sensations in our body. We're going to gently bring ourselves back, okay? So open your eyes if you are closed. Let the light in. And very gentle, observe the space you walk by, observe the room you're in. Notice how you feel. Beautiful. Talking about sensations, I will go back to that sensation of groundness, you know, that we we had learned in the past uh, classes, which is we're going to bring ourselves back to our bodies by ground through the sitting bones and sitting up straight and tall, okay? Raise your heart center, extend your spine, inhale through the nose as you grow taller, exhale, as you ground yourself, this is the sensation of grounding. Okay, we are always going to come back to this sensation because we want to move consciously. So we will not injure or hurt ourselves. Okay, so coming back to that sensation of, of mountain pose, of groundness, sit up straight and tall, lift your sternum a little bit, raise your heart center. And from this space, with your extended spine, as much as you can, we're going to inhale and raise the chin towards the sky, towards the ceiling. Try not to drop your head back. Keep your neck muscles engaged. Exhale, long and soft. Bring the chin towards the chest. Beautiful. Let's get into a flow here. Inhale three times, okay? Gaze towards the ceiling. Exhale. Bring the chin towards the chest. Inhale one more time. Up. Exhale down. Inhale, gaze up. Exhale, we're going to bring the head back to center, okay? Back to midline, back to the neutral position right here. Beautiful. Ground yourself one more time. And now inhale, we're going to gaze towards the right side. Turn the neck all the way to the right. It is comfortable for you and very gentle, long and soft exhalation. We're going to turn our head towards the left. One more time, inhale. Exhale. Let's get into a flow inhale. Exhale. One last time inhale. Exhale, long and soft through the mouth, bring your head back to center. Back to midline, release, beautiful. Lovely, we start adding some movements to our neck, very gentle, okay? Now we're going to add some neck rolls, so sitting up straight and tall. We're going to imagine that there is a white cone in front of us and we're gonna draw the number eight, okay? We're gonna do that three times each direction and I would love for you to 
explore your range of motion, okay? You can do a very tiny number eight and you can do a very huge number eight. Whatever feels good for your body today, right? At your own pace. Very good color, very good lacy, yeah? Gaze around the room in doing the number eight. You can do that in, two, in, in, the, in the opposite direction now. Beautiful. And now we're going to turn the number eight in the horizontal level, you know, in the horizontal plane. And we, we're going to do the infinite side. And let's try to do that three times as well, each direction. Are they gentle movements to our neck? Moving consciously. Beautiful. Bring yourself back to center, back to midline, and release. Lovely. It was nice. Now you're going to drop the right ears towards the right shoulder like that. Very good. And, you know, explore the movement here, swinging your neck all the way to the left. At your own pace. Very good, Lacey. Very good color. Yeah. Bring it back. If you'd like to add the breath here, you can go and do it. Otherwise, pay attention to the movement. Okay. We're going to swing one more time. And now, the next time we try to swing back, we're going to swing back, gazing towards the ceiling of your house. Try not to drop your head all the way back, okay? And then we can swing back. Very gentle. Maybe we can even do a 360 here if it's available to you. Very slowly at your own pace. Both sides as well, both directions. Moving consciously, folks. Being tender with ourselves, being gentle. And gentle, we're going to bring our head back to center one more time. Lovely, back to midline. And release. And we finish our neck warm ups. Okay, so coming down, we're going to warm up the shoulder. We're going to warm up the shoulder now. Okay, we're going to start the shoulder movements. And the first one we're going to do is the is the shoulder rolls that we're going to place our hands on our thighs like this. Okay. And then one shoulder at a time. Okay, we're going to raise the, the right shoulder up and bring it all the way back. And as we bring the right shoulder forward, we do the same thing with the left. Raise and back. Okay, let's do that a few times. And we'll take them both shoulders backwards. Very good, Colin, slowly, yes. Very good, Sam. Now we can rotate them forwards. Rotating the shoulders forwards. Moving the shoulders at our own pace. Beautiful. Let's do that one more time. And release. Just getting, you know, getting the the circulation flowing in our shoulders, okay? So release both hands parallel to your body, parallel to your wheelchair, like that, yes. And now with one shoulder at a time as well, we're going to raise one shoulder like that. 
Raise all the ways comfortable. Yeah. As we do that, beautiful. Right shoulder up. Left shoulder up. Very good. And release back to center. Back to midline. Now, we're going to uh, add some more rotation to our shoulders, but we're going to do that with one arm at a time, okay? So sit up straight and tall. Ground yourself through the same bones. And now we're going to take the left, the left hand, you know, and hold the left shoulder like that, yeah? Yes, very good. And out and at your own pace, we're going to rotate our shoulders. Here, I would love for you to find the range of motion as well, because we're going to rotate them five times forwards. Two, three, four. Five and five times backwards. One, don't pace, folks. Two, welcome back, Leslie. Three, four, five. Beautiful release. As you release now. Give your right arm a little shake, like that. You know, you might start feeling it's like warm now. It's, you know, we are warming up slowly. Now we're going to we're going to take the right hand and hold our wheelchair frame, okay? Because we're going to get a better balance when we hold the wheelchair frame. So we're going to do the same thing. We're going to bring ourselves back to our body first, ground yourself to the sitting bone, and take the left hand and kiss the right shoulder, the left shoulder like that. Very good, Carla. Very good. Sam. And at our own pace, we're going to start to move forward again. Okay, one, three times, and three times. Two, three. Four, five, beautiful. Now three times backwards. One, two, three, four. One more time. Five, lovely. Exhale, release. And as you release, don't forget to shake your left arm. Very good. Now we're going to open up our lower back, our, our upper back, our scapula, you know, our shoulder blades. We're going to do that by hugging ourselves, okay? Because when we, we hug, we extend, we open the shoulder blades. So we're going to release both hands like that, palms facing forwards, yeah? And now with the left arm up, we're going to inhale and we're going to squeeze in, you know, as much as you can. Very good, you know. Hold your hands, walk your hands in your shoulder blades like you do that. Beautiful, stay here. I call it the self-love hug. Exhale, open your arms wide again. Very good. Right arm up now, okay? This arm up now, okay? The opposite arm. Inhale, hug yourself again. Very good. Stay here. It's a good stretch, stretch. Beautiful, exhale, release, lovely. Give your arms a little shake. Very good, very good. Now, uh, coming down to working uh, with our arms, 
we're going to add a little strengthening in the arms, but also a little rotation in both shoulders, okay? We're going to do that five times, right? So sitting up straight and tall first, ground yourself to the sitting bones. Inhale, exhale, release your arms. Now we're going to inhale, we're going to raise your arms any amount. Yeah, exhale, keep your arms wild. Look at the, the palm of your hands are towards the floor now, okay? And now the rotation will come up, okay? Inhale, palms towards the ceiling. Beautiful. And just for the fact that we're holding our arm here, we are adding strengthening to the movement. Exhale, palms facing down. Beautiful, one more time, palms facing up. Arms facing down and release. As you release, give your arms a little shake and reposition yourself in the chair if you need to. And we, you know, warm up the, we did the warm up of the neck, of the shoulders, and now we're going to open the spine. We're going to open the spine in various directions. And I would like to do that uh, picking apples. I think we did this movement before. <laughs> we're going to pick apples. Uh, it's quite fun. And we're going, to, we're going to add a lot of movement to our spine picking apples. But before we go there, I would invite you to have a sip of your water. You know, just drink some water first before we start to the spine. Beautiful. How do you folks feel? Feel well? Yeah? Nice. Okay. Uh, with, the, with the movements of the spine, I would love for you to pay attention to a center of gravity. You know, we all have a center of gravity, you know. So it's here. When we're going to move, right, try to move from the midline out. And now always pay attention to your center of gravity. Never try to move yourself far from the center of gravity because it can be dangerous. For, for safety reason, always move from the midline out. And I always say for you to try to find the sweet spots between challenging and comfortable. You would like the movement to be comfortable, you know, but at the same time, a little bit challenging. So as we all have different abilities, I would love for you to pay attention to it, okay? And notice if it's comfortable, it's challenging, you know, and you can you can do it. So it means that it's safe, all right? So let's do first. Um, let's pick up the apples. We're gonna bake a, an apple pie. So imagine that we have a empty basket over here, and would love to fill that with apples. And we park our wheelchair, you know, in our garden, and there is like an apple tree just above us, a huge apple tree. We're gonna use our imagination here, folks. <laughs> so we park our wheelchair here and we need to fill up the, the basket. So the first thing we're going to do, we're going to pick apples that is right above our heads, you know. So we're going to hold our wheelchair frame to get a better balance and with the right hand, we're going to pick up the highest apple we can. So inhale through the nose, we're going to raise the right arm up, the right hand up, all the way we can. Notice the stretch in your arm and your back. Exhale through the mouth, put the apple inside the basket. Beautiful. Now the same thing, we're going to hold our wheelchair frame with the right hand and with the left arm. Inhale, whoa, let's pick up that apple all the way up there. Hold it there, take it, beautiful, put in the basket, lovely. 
reposition yourself in the chair, you know, to get a better balance because now we're going to try to pick two apples at the same time, okay? What I do here to get a better balance, I move my bump a little bit forward to the chair. So, you know, try to find a good balance before you raise both arms, up, all right? If it's not available, you do with one arm. Safe to first. So ground yourself to the sitting bones, sit up straight and tall. Inhale, we're going to pick two apples right above our head. All the way. Very good, Sam. Very good. And exhale, bring it down. Lovely. That's very good. We have four apples. It's not enough for the pie. It's not enough for the pie. So we're going to do that in a V shape now, okay? A V shape. There is an apple over there and one there. So we're going to inhale through the nose in a V shape. Oh, but extend it as much as you can. Yes. Exhale through the mouth. Bring the apple down. We have six apples. That's very good, but it's not enough. Not enough. Now with the right hand, we're going to pick up in the left diagonal side. So hold your wheelchair frame with the left hand. Ground yourself first and inhale. Right hand. All the way up, left side. Very good. Adding a little bit of twist here. Bring the apple down, put it inside the basket. Hold the root chair frame with the right hand. And now left hand, all the way, right side. Exhale. Beautiful. You can notice here that these movements that we're doing, Picking these imaginary apples are movements that can be translated to our day-to-day -day activities, which, like you know, it's really good for us because we are warming the body, so we can we can do this movement easily throughout the day. Right, uh, we have apples in the left and apples in the right, and now we're going to hold a wheelchair frame with the right hand. And remember what I told you about the 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 center of gravity. Okay, don't go far from your center of gravity. We're going to inhale and pick the apple on the left side, all the way to the left. Yes. Bring it back, put it there. Apple all the way to the right, all the way to the right. Exhale, bring your body back, beautiful. Very good, very good. Let's add a little twist now to the spine, a tiny twist. We're going to add twists, you know, very gentle. Hold your wheelchair frame, you know, and we're going to pick with the right hand an apple that is right in front of our left foot, right hand, left foot. If you cannot go all the way there, you go until it's comfortable, okay? Inhale, right hand, left foot. A forward fold and a gentle twist to the spine. Exhale, bring your body back. Very gentle. Very good. Nice. Let's do the same thing now. You know, a left hand, right foot now. Okay, left hand. We drop these apples on the floor. We need to pick them up now. Exhale, bring your body back. Beautiful. Put them inside the basket. Very good. What we're going to do now, we're going to add a little side bend, a little deep side bend. We're going to hold our wheelchair frame here and we're going to pick the app on the left side. It's available to you on the left side. You don't need to go all the way down, folks. Go until it's comfortable for you. Remember what I told you? Exhale, bring your body back, okay? Remember what I told you about comfortable and challenging, okay? Beautiful. Right side now. Let's pick it up on the right side. Yeah. Like you drop something on the floor, you pick it up. Very good. Very good. Bring your body back to center. Back to midline. Are you going to hold our wheelchair frame? And now we're going to broaden our chest. And we're going to pick apple all the way back, right back, all the way there. You can gaze to the palm of your hand as you pick the apple. Lovely. 
Exhale, bring it back. Very nice. Let's do the same thing with the left hand. Left hand, extend the left arm. Exhale, bring it down. Lovely, beautiful. We're going to, you know, pick up two apples that is right behind us. What we're going to do here is a slightly deeper twist. We're going to place our our right arm between our tights. We're gonna hold outside of our knee or our wheelchair frame. Get up straight and tall here, broaden your chest, inhale and pick the apple behind us with the left hand. Very good, Carlo, very good, Anne. yeah. Exhale, body back to center, very slowly. Very nice. You start to feel now your spine is waking up. You know, let's do the same thing. Right arm between your tights. Getting up straight and tall. Broaden your chest. Inhale. Extend your arm back. Pick up the last apple, folks. Exhale. Bring your body back to center. And bake a pie. <laughs> You're very good apple pickers. Amazing. Lovely. Nice. You know, we we did finish our apple picking. We have the apples. We're going to put them in the side. But now we're going to add some more warm-ups to our, to our spine, okay? We have 10 more minutes of warm-ups. Then we're going to we're going to add more repetitions. Then we're going to increase the pace. All right, so uh, I'm going to show you a variation of cat call, what in yoga we call cat call, which is a flexion and extension of the spine, okay? So I'm going to do that uh, first, and then we're going to do that five times, okay? So first of all, we place our hands outside of our knees like this, or you can place your hands in your wheelchair frame. You choose whatever is comfortable for you. And to get into a cat variation, we're going to arch our back like a cat. You know, bring the chin towards the chest. You're going to raise your shoulders and you're going to notice your shoulder blades are opening up. Your shoulder blades are walking away from each other. That is the cat variation. In here, we're going to have a long exhalation through the mouth. Flex the spine. And then we're going to pull the femur bone back to the hip sockets as we broaden our chest and gaze towards the ceiling. You know, open the hearts. Notice that your shoulder blades are towards each other now. We're going to have a deep inhale here to the nose as we keep our spine extended. And exhale back to cats, okay? You can also use the wheelchair frame to broaden your chest, okay? Whatever is comfortable for you, all right? So that is a cat call variation. We're going to do that for five breaths, for five times, okay? Be gentle, all right? Be gentle. I know that some of us has, you know, a thoracic injury. So when we work this fine, be very gentle. If you'd like to focus only on the shoulder blades, you can open your shoulder blades up in the cat and close your shoulder blades, broaden your chest on the call. You know, it can be subtle or can be deep, okay? The amplitude, the, the range of motion of the movements, you're going to adapt that to your body, all right? So we're going to do that through five breaths. I'm going to kill for the first two, but and then we're going to... We're going to, to go out uh, in, in our own pace. Are you folks ready? Yeah? Lovely. Okay, sit up straight and tall. Ground yourself to the sitting bones. Inhale to the nose. Exhale, get into cats. Everyone is a cat. Arch your back. Beautiful. A lot of cats in the room. Inhale, we're going to get into call. Extend the spine, open your heart, broaden your chest. Notice your shoulder blades are walking towards each other. 
Beautiful. Stay here. Exhale back to cat one more time. Arch your back. Stay here. Flex your spine as you exhale. Inhale. Back to call. Extend the spine. Gaze towards the sky, towards the ceiling of your room. Chest is broadened. Exhale back to cats. Your shoulder blades are far away from each other now. Notice them. Inhale back to call. Lovely. One more time. Back to cats. Inhale. Pull your femoral bones back to the hip sockets as you broaden your chest and extend your spine one more time. And long and soft exhalation through the mouth. We're going to Get to cats and release. As you release, you can reposition yourself in the chair, give your arms a little shake, and also give yourself a little pressure relief, okay? You know, let's get some air to, you know, our sitting bones. That is a very important thing for wheelchair users. Always pressure release, you know? Rock your body from side to side. Very good, very good, folks. And bring your body back to midline, back to center. Lovely. Now uh, we're going to add a little twist to the spine, okay? So we're going to start very slowly, bringing the twist like, you know, uh, slightly increasing the movement as time passed by. But uh, first of all, we're going to raise, you know, uh, our right arm like this. And then we're going to bring the right arm between our tights like that. And in here, just this movement is already, you know, a little twist. And then the left hand, we're going to bring at the back of the wheel or the back of the chair. There you go. Keep your spine engaged, elongated as you gaze here towards the left side. Lovely. Inhale through the nose. And exhale long and soft. You bring your body back to center. Back to midline. Beautiful. Inhale, raise your left arm up. Exhale between your tights, right hand, the back of the wheel, the back of the chair, and you gaze towards the right side here. Notice this stretch in your spine. Inhale up. Exhale, bring your body back to center, back to midline. Beautiful. Lovely. We put the arm on the tights now, okay, this time. Now we're going to add a little bit of depth into the twist. We're going to put the arm outside of the knee, okay? The right hand outside of the left knee and the left hand outside of the right knee, slightly deeper. Okay, so sit up straight and tall, release both hands parallel to your body. Very good. Welcome, Beth. I haven't seen you. Hello, Nana. Inhale, raise your arm in your mouth. Very nice. Exhale, right arm outside of your left knee. And left hand at the back of the chair. There you go. It's slightly deeper now. The deeper twist. Gaze here towards the left side. Hold it here. Inhale through the nose, deep inhale. And 
and soft exhale, long and soft exhale, bring your body back to center, back to midline, beautiful, lovely. Release, release your, your arms parallel to your chair one more time, inhale, raise your hands, raise your arm, any amount, very good Sam, very good, and exhale, long and soft, left hand outside of the right knee, and the right hand at the back of the wheel, back of the chair. Spine engaged here, folks. Gaze towards the right side. Stay here. Inhale, deep inhale here through the nose. Exhale, long and soft through the mouth as we move back to center. Back to midline and release. Give your arms a little shake. And we finish working with the spine. We finish to warm up the body. Well done, everybody. Well done, everyone. So from now on, you know, now it's been 45 minutes. So we're going to finish the, the last 30 minutes with a higher, higher tempo, mindful movements, okay? But before we get there, I would invite you to have another sip of your water. Anne is doing very good. She's, you know, she's bringing my mind. <laughs> lovely yes all right folks so uh we we did finish up uh, warming up the body and we'll open up the spine and now we're going to uh, add some more like movements and the first one is going to be the side bends we're going to do like 10 side bends each side but we're going to do that like uh, at uh, our own pace. What are we going to do? I would like you to hold your, your wheelchair frame if you don't have a good balance. And then you're going to do this movement, you know, right side, yeah. And then bring it back and then left side. Very good. We're going to do that 10 times now, okay? In the faster pace, more dynamic pace. Yes, beautiful. One, there you go. Right. Two. Beautiful. Left side. Right side, three. Left side going slightly deeper, you know. Four left side, right side, five right side. Your folks are doing so well. <laughs> Six, yes, left side. Right side. Seven. Left side. Right side. Eight. Left side. Right side. Almost there, folks. Nine. Right side. Very good. Last one, 10. Left side, beautiful. Exhale, release, lovely. Notice how you feel, give your arms a little shake. Nice. Very good. The, the, uh, next, the next exercise, I'm gonna show you first and then we're going to do that 10 times as well, okay? We're gonna hold the wheelchair frame and then we're going to raise, you know, our hand all the way up and gaze, you know, to the palm of our hands. And then we're going to swing all the way back like that with the palms towards the, uh, the wall. And then we're going to turn our head towards the left. Inhale up, exhale towards the left, right? That is the movement. Hala, you're going to do that. Put your arms in front of you like this and back. 
front and back. Okay? And all the others, we're going to raise the hands. Understood? Yeah? We're going to do that 10 times each arm. Okay, folks? Lovely. But again, if you want to do less, just be my guest. <laughs> Sit up straight and tall. Inhale. Gaze to the palm of your hand. Raise your head a little bit. And now the head gaze to the left side as you bring your head backwards. Lovely. One. Up. Back. Two. Lovely. Let's do it dynamically. Inhale. Three. Raise your arm. Bring your hand back. Four. Beautiful. Inhale, five, inhale, don't forget to gaze towards the left side, six, inhale, gaze up, exhale, gaze left, seven, inhale, gaze up, exhale, gaze left, eight, inhale, Nine, the last one, folks. Exhale, beautiful. Back to center. And give your right arm a little shake. Lovely. Reposition yourself in the chair. Hold your wheelchair frame. And we're going to do the same thing with the left arm, okay? Inhale up. Gaze back now to the right side. One, inhale, gaze up, left side, two, inhale, three, inhale, raise your arm, exhale, bring your arm back, four, beautiful, inhale, up, exhale, Five, inhale up, exhale, six, lovely, inhale up, seven, three more folks, eight, one more time, inhale, nine, and last time now, inhale, exhale, gaze to the right side, and release, give your right, left arm a little shake, lovely, reposition yourself in the chair, well done, you all did very well, beautiful, so we're going to add a similar movement, but now we're going to raise our arm up and we're going to bring our elbow all the way to the right and gaze to the left. Okay, you can hold your wheelchair frame to get a better balance. So we're going to do this. Right? For Carla, you can do like that, Carla. We can go forwards, backward, forwards, backward, and work with the neck as well, okay? Yes, like this. Lovely, Carla. All right. Yes, Beth, exactly like that. Up, you know, push the elbow like that, align the elbow with the shoulders, you know, and gaze, gaze to the opposite arm, let's say. Yeah. Lovely. We're going to do that five times each arm, okay? Are you folks ready? Yeah? Five times each arm, okay? Sit up, sit and tall. Inhale up. Exhale, push the elbow to the right and gaze towards the left. One, inhale up. Two, inhale. Three, try to align the elbow with the shoulders. Four, one more time. Five, lovely, release, 
hold your wheelchair frame, get a better balance, sit up straight and tall. Right, left arm now, inhale up. Left shoulder, left elbow all the way to the left. Gaze towards the right side. One, inhale, raise your arm up. Two. Beautiful, inhale. Three. One more time, inhale. Four. Inhale, one last time, five, and release. Shake your arms, reposition yourself in the chair, and I invite you to have a sip of the water now, another, another water drinking time, folks. How's everyone doing? Thumbs up? Everyone's okay? Lovely. Great. We're going to do now the diagonal reach, okay? A little bit higher tempo, okay? We're going to do that 10 times each arm. I'm going to count. Don't work with the breath now, okay? You can use whatever breath is comfortable for you. Pay attention to the movements. You know, like, like we're going to high five in, in the diagonal, like, you know, like this. One, two, all the way, okay? Try to bring, working with the torso as well as you do that, okay? This way, all right? So we're going to do that 10 times each arm. I'm going to count for us. So sit up straight and tall. Let's go. One. Beautiful. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Whoa, give your arms a little shake. Now we start from the right side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Beautiful. Give your arms a little shake. Bring your body back to center. Lovely. That was the diagonal reach. Now we're going to do the fire exit arms. One, raise both arms and push the walls. That is one, okay? For Carla, I think you remember, instead of raising your arm up, you're going to bring them forward like that, and then push, and then bring them in front of you forward and push, okay? Did you understand, Carla? Lovely. And all the others, we're gonna raise our arms. So as we're gonna raise our arms, make sure you have a good balance, okay? Yes, like Les is doing, you know, move a little bit forward in the chair so you can have a good balance, so you can raise both arms at the same time. Right, are you folks ready? Yeah, shall we do that? Beautiful, let's go. Inhale, up. One. Up. Two. Dynamic, folks, yes. Up. Three. Up. Four. Up. Five. Up, six, up, seven, up, eight, up, nine, up, ten. Beautiful. Give your arms a little shake. Well done, everybody. Yes. Nice. Sorry, you would stay there. So now we're going to add the sun salutations. Uh, we're going to do 10 sun salutations. I'm going to explain them to you one more time, and then we're going to do it together. Then I'm going to explain the variation to color, okay? So you're going to inhale, raise both arms up, exhale, get into a forward fold. 
Do you remember forward fold until it's comfortable for you? Okay. Exhale, bring your body back to center. And then we're going to get into cats. Call. Extend the spine. Back to center. Inhale, up and down. That is one. Pokala, we're going to swim your arms in front of you. Get into a forward fold. Bring your body back to center. Cat, call. Swing your arms in front of you one more time. And finish like this. Beautiful. Did you understand, Carla? Lovely. All right. We're going to do that 10 times, okay? Are you folks ready? Yes. I like to see that. Well, well done, Beth. Okay, folks, let's do that, okay? I'm going to kill you. Uh, but, like, uh, try to do it at your own pace, okay? Do it slowly and listen to your body, okay? Especially when you do a forward fold, okay? Because sometimes it's hard to bring our body back to center, so take your time, okay? So sit up sure and tall, inhale through the nose, exhale through the mouth, here we go, inhale up, exhale forward fold, inhale back to center, very good, call cats, exhale cats, Inhale, call. Exhale, back to Santa. Inhale. Raise your arm one more time. One. Beautiful. Inhale, up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, back to Santa. Get. Arch your back like a cat. Extend your back like a call. Back to center. Inhale, raise your arm one more time. Number two. That's beautiful, folks. Doing very well. Inhale one more time. Raise your arm in your mount. Exhale, forward folds. And slowly use your biceps and bring your body back to center. On the inhale. Lovely. Back to cat, arch your back, flex your back like a cat. Extend your spine like a call. Back to center, inhale, raise your arms. Three. Let me reposition myself here. Beautiful. Inhale up. Exhale, forward fold. Back to center. Arch your back like a cat. Extend your spine. Broaden your chest. Back to center. Inhale. Raise your arms. Anjali Mudra. Beautiful. One more time. That was number four. Inhale up. Exhale. Forward folds. Back to center. And inhale. Arch your back like a cat. Extend your spine. Back to center. Raise your arms. Number five. Beautiful. Lovely. Five more folks. Inhale up. Forward fold. Arch your back like a cat. Extend your spine. Back to center. Inhale, raise your arms. And number six. Inhale up. Forward fold. Inhale, bring your body back to center. Arch your back like a cat. Extend like a cock. Back to center, raise your arm one more time. Heart center, number seven. Three more folks, inhale up. Forward folds. 
Back to center. Catch. Call. Back to center. Raise your arms, number eight. Beautiful. Inhale up. Forward fold. Bring your body back to center. Arch your back. Broaden your chest, call. Back to center. Raise your arm one more time. That's lovely. That was the number nine. That is the last one now. Inhale up. Forward folds. Body back to center. Get. Call. Back to center. Raise your arms. And release. Nice. You folks did so well. <laughs> and now let's do that pressure release exercise that we do. Rock your body from side to side. Very nice. Very nice. And now we're going to work with our core a little bit, okay? And for that, I would like to suggest for you to grab the, the block. Do remember that we use the block, or we use the book, or we use a phone, whatever you have. Very nice, Sam. Um, do you have something there, Carla? Yeah, Beth? Yes, that's lovely. That's lovely, Carla. Lovely, Sam. Yeah. Beautiful. Very good. Anne, can see you have a block there. Yeah. Right. We're going to press the block against each other like this. Okay. Or, and then we're going to extend our arms, engage the muscles of your arms like that. And then we're going to inhale, raise the block up. Yeah, that is good for your color. Very good. Exhale, bring it down. Inhale up. Exhale to the right side. Inhale up. Exhale to the left. Inhale up. Exhale down. Lovely. That was it. Let's do that one more time, okay? Inhale all the way up. Exhale down. Inhale up. Exhale to the right. Inhale up. Exhale to the left. Inhale up. Exhale down. Lovely, that's lovely. Now we're going to hold the block like this. And then we're going to bring the block in front of us. Yes, like that, okay? And now we're going to do that 10 times. We're going to bring the block in front of our heart center. And then we're going to extend the block in front of us. Right? Let's do that. Inhale. Exhale. One. Inhale, two, exhale. Inhale, three, exhale. Inhale, four, exhale. Inhale, five, exhale. Inhale, six, Exhale. Inhale, seven. Exhale, two more folks, three more. Inhale, eight. Exhale. Inhale, nine. Exhale. And inhale. And, and release. 
Zen released the blog. Well done, everybody. Give your arms a little shake, you know. And let's bring ourselves back to that position where it's very comfortable in our chair. Going to release all the tension. Let's place one hand in our heart center, another one in our belly. Have a deep inhale through the nose here. Inhale very deep. Exhale with a little sigh. Ah. One more time. Inhale. Ah. Lovely. Replace your hands on your tights. Close your eyes. Let's take a, a time here to notice how you feel. Relax your shoulders. Notice your energy levels, your sense of calmness. Beautiful. Release your arms one more time, close to your body. Inhale, raise your arm any amount. And we're going to close with our heart center pose. Pray your hands in front of our heart. Thank you very much for this practice one more time.